if 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 Payet <laughs> is gonna go, then let him go. Exactly. Let him go exactly. because it, listen, you can't deny any player. If, if Paris Saint Germain, he's he's obviously French. Mm. They're the biggest club in France. If Real Madrid want him, you can't stop him going. Mm. But I personally don't think he's gonna go. No. I think someone made a good point yesterday. Maybe they're trying to keep him out of the radar until the transfer window yeah, shut. Yeah. yeah, and then the, and the, then, the then problem is the problem for me is is that. No one in the club has come out and said anything. No, and nor has Payet. Payet's not come out and said, I want to leave. No. Payet's not said, I'm not happy in London or I'm not happy at West Ham. He's been training, he's been smiling. Mm. Maybe he has got a little knock. We don't I, know, do I, we? I, I think, personally, right, I think there's more to it. I think there's more to it. I think that <coughs> they may, may be looking at the possibility of letting him go for good money, yeah? Mm. Um but I think it all depends on whether we can get what they... If, he, but the thing is, if he's, he's going to go to Madrid, he's going to go to Madrid, say, all right, go to Madrid, but we want Rodriguez. But Rodriguez might want to play for us. But then you don't have Payet. It's, it's we, one of them... Fit, because I, the thing is, what I've said about that, Payet, right, people saying he ain't been at training, he was blah, blah, blah. But he blah. has been he's at been training. training. I, I know, yeah, I, yeah, I know that. Yeah. yeah, But people have been saying he hasn't been in training. He has, it, it's it's rumour circulation. But what I think, right, is... You go to Man City, Payet is going to be a better chance of winning than not, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's an understatement, to be honest. Maybe you looked at this, like, you could look at things like maybe looked at the system and thought, he's not going to fit in, so I might as well leave him at home, not risk him. Mm -hmm. um, but I don't think you go to Manchester, right, without him. The thing is, though, uh, you don't pull a player like him for a niggle out of a squad the night before the game without taking him there. Like you take him and you assess him in the morning if he's right. if he's no, injured. The thing is, Billy did come out and say he did. He did. He come out and said Lanzini and Payet will see how they are on Saturday. Yeah, and the thing is as well, Payet, right? He, it was a last minute decision not to take him. If we would have took him and played him and he would have got injured, we would have been. Fucking mad. Why are you playing him? Just like Andy Carroll's situation. So maybe, I mean, Billy Chang is a stupid man. Billy don't care that he might be linked to Madrid. He picks the team. It's his player. He picks the team. If the ball, if, I'll tell you, you something now. If the ball turned get, around and said to Billy, got, you're, you're not picking him. I think Billy would walk out. No, I don't think so. No, I think that's protocol. You know, he could be, he could have that team written on on a piece of paper on Saturday, and David Sullivan might have rung him up. Or, well, I'm not saying this is happening. Mm. This is speculation. I'm just saying this is what I think happens to clubs. And go, um, sorry, Slav, but um, we've had an inquiry from PSG. Uh, you have to scrub him from the squad tonight because he might have to go elsewhere tomorrow. Mm. Yeah. Um, and I think that's protocol in football. I don't think it's one of them th things where he goes, no, he's playing because he's. If he's gonna go, yeah. But he's if he's gonna, gonna, go. gonna go, then he would have been on his way to France now. He'd have been, mm. but he's not. He's not. There's How no rumours. He, he might be there now. Not, we, we don't know what they do. Yeah, mate. The, the way things are like now, social media is 24 hours a day. Someone would have picked up on that and it'd have been out there. Yeah, exactly. And look yeah. how many people yeah, that, can that, take that, photos. That, and that, that might not be necessarily true. Some deals for players are done here. In London, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, they're, I, I mean, mean like, yeah. no, but there's, there's always there's someone that knows yeah, something. Something would have been, been, been done in, in, said. In, in on a yacht in. Listen, all the, all the rumour reels, all the rumour like reels from the people in the media side of it. None of them have turned around and said that he's definitely going. But then none I of them have turned around go. and said he's definitely staying. I don't think you'll go, but I do think, right? This is my personal opinion. I do think if a bid like that come in, they would accept it. But I think they would accept it. Only on the on the fact if they had a suitable replacement, like an excitable Where replacement. Where are you going <laughs> to find someone like that in three days? In three days, yes. you're not. And, you're and not. that's the thing. Not. The, 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 that is the Payet's big thing. not going to go right? unless unless the deal is to take the player plus money and we get a player. You can't. No. There's no way I, I, that we I, could I, sell. I, I, and and sell who says for a club can accept a bid? Else. But if the player don't want to go, he don't go. Payet might not want to go. No, I don't think that's true. The club want you out, you go. Yeah, no, a lot, a lot of time. Not really. Yeah. No, no, why? I take Because that's why Sacco's still sitting there earning exactly. wage. Exactly. Why, why, if, if they accept a bid for him, if he don't want to go, what can they do? He just refused to go. Well, he sits and does and, nothing. And, well, and West Ham ain't going to play him. Listen, go but, right, when, why Sacco ain't playing? When, when There's the a difference between Sacco and Pyatt. When the Abramovich money first came in at Chelsea, they signed um, Winston Bogart. 
Right, they turned around and said to him, oh, we're going to sell you, isn't that? So, right, money, enough money, I'm going to go and play with you. Exactly. Team. And that's what you exactly. did. Exactly, Pyatt can sit they there for the next five him. years. That's it. You know, if he don't want to go, he's ha he might be happy. He's, he's already come out and said that his family's happy in London. Rio Ferdinand didn't want to leave West Ham. Why does he leave West Ham then? Who said Rio Ferdinand didn't want to leave Rio West Ham? Rio Ferdinand. Yeah, to be fair, I don't believe that. Harry Redknapp said it. Yeah, yeah, well, yeah, come on, Harry Redknapp said that. No, I'm just saying, <laughs> listen, two, two Harry Redknapp would we'll know the best. Harry Redknapp, yeah. you had Terry leave. Brown in charge at the time, and Harry Redknapp. Sometimes Joe Cole didn't want to leave. Yeah, no, I'm going to say Joe Cole did want to leave. Bellamy, no, he didn't. Bellamy, he did. no, he didn't. He did. Bellamy, didn't, want Bellamy didn't want to leave. Yeah, there's another one. Bellamy didn't yeah, want to leave. Yeah, but if the thing is, right, how can you sit there for a club? Yeah. Some people will dig their heels in, yeah, like Sacco. Yeah, like Sacco. Yeah, some people will dig their heels in. But how can you be sitting there at a club and someone come in your office and go, Craig? Say so Bellamy, right? Uh, Man City been on the phone. If offered forty million quid, we've accepted it. Pack your bags and go. What are you gonna say? That's nah, all right. Well, he did. You, you just, he did say that. But you just think to yourself, well, they don't fucking want me. What's no, the point? He in did being say that. that. So you read yeah. his book. He, he said, no, nah, I don't want to go. Yeah. And then they made it clear. No, look. You're we going, want, we, we want need the money. The money. Well, there you go then. Yeah. Yeah. You're answering yeah. your own question. Yeah, but then Pyatt might not want to do that. Pyatt might stick to his guns. And but I don't see what the point, you've just contradicted yourself. Yeah, you're I'm just contradicting yeah, no, myself. No, no, one player out of three you fucking said. No, they, no, if, no, you, no. if they tell I've you to go, myself. You, of course you have, because you said if they don't want to go, no, they won't no, go. No, he no. said he don't want to go. Yeah, he don't want to go. Yeah, he don't want to go. And then you just told me they told him he's going. Transfer deadline day. What is it? Transfer deadline day. Transfer deadline day. Like the window's shutting. Like, you I know think, what I mean? I think, I think, I think the difference... That makes no sense. No, no, no. I think they the tell you to go, you go. I, I think the difference with someone like well, Bellamy... Why is fucking Sacco right. still sitting there then? Because he's a cunt. It's, well, it's he's one still in sitting there though. Yeah, but it's one in... He's still sitting there. How many people do you know first... Hold on, Scott. How many people do you know first teamers that are still sitting in their youth team? They move on. Because yeah. the club don't want them. But, We're not talking about that. How many players have we wanted to get rid of? The difference is as well. Well, we don't. We don't now. Well, we do. Well, we want to get rid of Sacco. But it's, it's, That's it's how much, dug his heels in. But it's Valencia. how much the player wants to play football. Exactly. If Payet comes out and says, right. oh, I love this club, surely the owners will think, right. all right, you, you know you, what? You've got a player like Payet, right? Craig Bellamy, they, as I said, Bellamy didn't want to go. They probably said, look, we're going to sell you. You're not going to play. Right? He was getting to that age where... He would play. But... If they have come out and said you ain't going to play, there's no way West Ham could turn around and say to Pyatt, exactly. if you don't go, we're exactly. not going to play. Pyatt, you're going to sit in the stand for five years. You're one matter. of the best players in it the world. Matter. All I'm saying is, if the club want to get rid of you, you go. But no, but no you matter might not. Want to tell you might not. Sacco you don't matter if you want to go. Yeah, but, they, but because they could just turn around and say to you, all right, you don't play then. I mean, a lot of a lot of it. So so people like Sacco are happy to sit there. Exactly. But then Pyatt, Pyatt well, might Pyatt sit there. She's got into the France. But there's no way Pyatt's going to sit on. Footballers want to be left in the stand. So, some of them. If, like you say, the club don't want you, you think, well, I want first team football. Exactly. Yeah, but I was so just. So, if you don't, you know, if, you, if you, the club wants to get rid of you, I can't wait until this transfer window is shut and Pyatt starts against Watford because this is going to look like Pyatt, a load of old bollocks because we don't know what the fuck's going on. We don't run the club. We don't know what's going on behind the scenes. We're not agents. Pyatt's at me. We're at me. David Sullivan's come out and said, we're not selling him. Done. There's been no rumours that he's going anywhere. Done. So no, there I, are don't know, I don't there's know what we're doing. There's fucking rumours every day. There's, there's, there's going to be rumours. Of course there's going to be rumours. You've got, no. you've got <laughs> one of the best players in no, Europe last season. What do you of course mean? there's going to be rumours. Hey, what do you mean? There's no rumours. There's rumours every said, day. Yeah. Rumours. He if, said he was happy to stay. No, exactly. If, nothing, if, there's nothing concrete. Is that ain't a rumour. A rumour is somebody saying. we've been to this season, people have said to us, Pyatt's going. Yeah, but that's always... Listen, listen, that's going to happen. That's what happens when you've got a world-class player like that in your team. That's what. Look, when a world class player plays for Barcelona, how many rumours do you hear Messi's leaving? No. None. Right? Urza at Arsenal, Sanchez not leaving. When it's a club like West Ham who mm. get a player like that, that's when the rumours are going to start. Yeah, I'm that's, put him in that's, an that's what happens. Mm. But listen, like I said, Pyatt ain't. I, I believe Pyatt's not going to go nowhere. That's that's my fault. To, to be a, I just uh, think they're keeping him out of the shop window. If Pyatt come out and said, I want to leave. Then bye bye. Mm. Right, I, listen, I, 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 I hope he stays. To start I want him up. to stay, but if we are going to sell him, don't do it on transfer deadline day. That's all I'm saying. No, because we won't be able to replace right. him. Right. He's not going anywhere. So Thank you very much. <laughs> Thank you very much for joining us for this edition of West Ham Fan TV's post match punt. Little international break. So we're going to take the next uh, next week off. Good luck, Mikel Antonio. Yeah, yeah. oh yeah, let's talk about that before we go. Mikel Antonio got into the England squad. I'm over the moon for the boy. Well, I must admit, I think Big Sam must have watched Ryan's roundup when they will give him the wink, you know. Do you know what I do, Sam, it does concern me about that, and I'm always the one to bring the negative to the table, right, is 
He keeps on playing right back. Now he's broken into the England team. Come January, if we ended in a transfer request, I think. But I don't know because I'm sure Allardyce has come out and said his his performance is at right back's one of the reasons why he's picked him. Did he really? Yeah, no, I could he's be wrong. Him as a midfielder though. Yeah, no, yeah he's, he's named he him as a midfielder. In the squad. But... Nah, he, he, I watched his interview last night. I don't even remember him saying that once. No, I said, I, I'm saying he might not have. <laughs> he didn't say that. He, he turned he around and said, that up. He, 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 he <laughs> made that up. Sure no, sure he turned around and morning. said, his exact words were, he come out and said that he's, from going from a championship player to the way he took to the premiership last season mm. is the reason why. <laughs> but the thing mm. is, he, he fully deserves it. As you said, when we look when we played Man City last season, the guy made his debut being thrust in, you know, he couldn't get a sniff of a game until he got the injuries. And now he's being picked for England. This, this is England. what I like about Big Sam, and I think this is why it's going to be refreshing for England, because players that deserve a chance will get a chance. Mm. Yes, he has picked a similar sort of squad, but he can't drop everyone straight away. Oh, no, he's brought drink water And back plus, in, he? what we had out in the Euros, barring a couple of players, was the best that we've got at the moment. Yeah, yeah, so he's yeah. got to build yeah. around that now. So and I think, obviously, Creswell, when he comes back, might get a chance. Noble, I thought, might have had a chance. But I think, I think Noble, if he's going to get a chance, it'll be when we have a friendly, a couple of friendlies. I don't, I don't think Noble's had the best start to the season no. before, isn't it? I don't think he's going to get a chance. No. Now. And, and, and to, to, to be honest, part, I, I know last season... Performances, yeah, last season, we all, we all want Noble to play for England. I think Noble deserves to have that on his CV that he represented his country. And maybe he might get a couple of chances. At least to try him, at least. For me, Antonio, no-brainer. And I'm so, I was so happy Big Sam's picked him. And, and that's to credit what I think Big Sam's going to bring to England. He's going to give players that deserve a chance a chance and not because who you play for yeah. good mm. anyway thank you as I said before thank you very much <laughs> for joining us for this edition of West Ham Fan TV's post match point international break next week good luck to Mikel Antonio and Adrian and, and well Adrian. done Adrian yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's all about the Spain squad um, yeah but good luck to them two boys and, and the rest of the boys and Ogbonna uh, and Payet and, and uh, Payet yeah whoever's got called up to international uh, thing. We've got some content coming up. We've got a match day experience that'll be going up tomorrow. Uh, that's a good one, right, isn't it? Yeah, I loved it. Even, uh, even though I had a bad result, it was a good laugh. Cut a special guest in there. Free. Wink, wink. A <laughs> 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 uh, couple of special guests in there. Um, so, yeah, keep an eye out for that. We've got on a social coming up on. Wednesday, what's the day today? Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. 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 Yeah, Wednesday. you picked your competition winner, yeah? Yes, I yeah. have. Yes, right. So, <laughs> Graham's got a competition winner. Um, got international break, but we'll have content going up, so don't unsubscribe. Go and subscribe. We're close to 10k. We're I gonna, think he's got to do karaoke. Yeah, I've got to do karaoke. <laughs> I'm gonna sing After the Watford game in the Langfong. So, when we hit that 10k, <laughs> um, yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll mention that. I'll mention that in a different video anyway, but um, yeah, subscribe, leave a like on the video. Go and check out our website, www.westhamfan.tv. Go and follow us on Twitter, at westhamfantv, facebook.com forward slash westhamfantv. One thing left to say, boys. Come, come on, your eyes. eyes.